Hi learners. Today's class we are going to study about the floral formula and the floral diagram of uh, Hibiscus rosa sinensis, which is also called China rosa or shoe flower that belongs to the family Malvaceae. Hibiscus flower. It has a bract, so we will represent it in the symbolic manner. That is by floral formula: bracteate, bracteolate, actinomorphic, that is radially symmetrical, bisexual, calyx with five sepals, gamma sepals, corolla with five petals, and rarely slightly the base is fused with dilation, exactly not epipetalous. Andrisium with indefinite number of stamens which are fused with the filaments forming the terminal tube having monodelicous condition. Gynesium with the pentacarpillary syncorpus superior ovary that is hypogynous. Here we find this is the bract and these are the bracteoles which are modified to form the epicalyx a whorl around the Calyx and this is calyx containing five petals, sorry, five sepals. These five sepals are with valvular distribution without any overlapping of the margin, and also you can find clearly there will be joining or fusion of the margins with each other to form a complex structure. It is called gamma sepals, and the petals with five uh, five number and. It is slightly fused with the terminal tube. Ovary is pentacarpillary syncarpus superior with the axial placentation. You can see placenta in a green color and the ovules are represented in blue. And the locules, five locules are there. That's why it's called pentalocular. So pentacarpillary syncarpus superior ovary, pentalocular. Two ovules in each locule. And surrounding this, you can represent the terminal tube containing. Monotheus anthers, which is a characteristic feature of family Malvaceae. This is the posterior side. This is the anterior side. This is the this is the posterior side. This is the anterior side. This is the floral diagram. This is floral formula. Floral formula. Once again, I will highlight. Bracteate, bracteolate means bract is present, bracteole is present, actinomorphic, radially symmetrical, bisexual. Yeah, like, uh, both the essential parts of the flower are present. Uh, that is, uh, androecium and gynecium in a single plant. Here is with uh, five sepals and it is gamma sepals. Corolla with five petals. It is with twisted distribution with regular overlapping of the margin and uh, it is without any fusion. Androecium with indefinite number of stamens. Uh, With the monodelphous condition, having terminal tube, that's why I have shown the around the ovary, the circular structure that is terminal tube, and very very slightly diffused with the corolla tube, not exactly epipetalous. And gynecium with the pentacarpillary syncarpus superior ovary, that is hypogynous condition. And I hope here the floral diagram and floral formula of Hibiscus flower was made easy and. How to draw this diagram? And just I give a hint. I won't draw it again. Just sepals. You should draw like this. Always. Petals should be drawn. Always like this. And since it is a monodelphous stamens, and also with the monotheca center. Each anther you can represent by a line and a kidney-shaped anther lobe like, like this in hibiscus. Or else you will be drawing the anthers in the form of this structure. If you represent the dithecus anther like this, stamens. Is it clear with the floral diagram and floral formula? Oh. This will be helpful for the students uh, to draw the floral diagram and floral formula. And here, how to draw this uh, twisted distribution and the valve distribution? Valve, we can draw one, two, three, four, five. The margins will just 
the fuse means like this and each one we can draw with the margin like this free hand items you should draw and if you draw the petals take the middle part of each one one two three four and five and you can draw like this same to it is twister distribution that is regular overlapping of the margin and the rest of those bracket and bracket also will not be present in all the flowers and it is present you can represent like that if it is a dry mirror you can represent 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 Five meters plus. So in the morning process, it's a dicot plant. Twenty meters plus. Hope in this video how to draw the floral diagram to draw it made clear. If you like this video, please subscribe and also leave comments. Thank you very much.